you're looking at one bed versus two bed houses in Lagos, uh, not only really for sale, you might be building um, a, a housing project and you are looking at what exactly should you build, should you build one bed, should you build two beds, should you build three beds, this video will also be of assistance to you. Is real estate is demand based. If your property is not in demand, that investment is just like a waste because you are either going, not going to be earning enough from that investment or will not be earning one at all. Bed, one bed in Lagos right now has a very high demand. And that's because the bulk of the population in Lagos right now, we have more population in the working class or in the working category than those at the retirement class. That at least every two years or every three years, your house will be empty your house will be vacant which means that you are not going to be having long serving for tenants two <laughs> for two bed houses you get a higher rental appreciation so which means that whatever you are collecting for as rent for your two bed right now as well as the location is fantastic uh, in a matter of four years or five years the value of your rent can go as high as 25 to 30 percent long term tenants people can be in your house for like four five years uh, on like a one bed where almost every two years or every year um you may have you may be having a new tenant but for a two bed you can have a tenant there for four years can have a tenant there for five years particularly for married married couples after like their second child a lot of people are doing just two shines right now and they may decide to just be there for like maybe four years five years before they decide that okay let's also move to our own to our own space or to our own apartment